Czyli ktoś się otworzy tak. A tak to mu się otworzy tak. I to wróciłeś, on dalej zostanie na kąpie taki. Dobrze. Niestety mamy po sensorze mamy w łapanym. Zostały jeszcze jabłka. Można wziąć do domu, jak nie to ja wezmę, do teściowej. Ona pewnie jakieś pyszne ciasto upiecze. Yy, natomiast w dniu jutrzejszym będzie masa konkursu w różnego rodzaju, ponieważ zostały nam jeszcze książki ufundowane przez wydawnictwo Helion, zostały torby od Microsoftu, koszulki, o nawet taka w wersji polo. Może... Nie ma ja Nie ma Nie ma ja Nie ma ja Nie ma ja Nie ma ja Nie ma Teraz przyjdziemy na drugą stronę. Polo L. El Polo. Koszulka biała z... Z jakiej firmy w ogóle? To jest firma... Nie, to jest społeczność i są takie trzy... marchewki w różnych kolorach. W tą stronę teraz tam do tyłu. Piękny rzut. Nie wiem, co A! Podejdę troszeczkę. Cheater! O! Bardzo ładnie. To był taki rzut nad ziemią. Ale to przez wiatr wszystko. Tutaj mam pogodę, widzimy, że jest ciemnia, czyli zbliża się wieczór już. Ewentualnie jak było ktoś techniczny, bo by pomógł nam jeszcze. Wystarczy, że staną informatyk obok i już. Który ma jabłko. Który ma jabłko, no tak. Przekazał coś mocy. Hakery maple. Geniusze, tak to jest. Nie? Geniusze Apple. Tych całych. Wait moment. Oh. Yeah, now it's works. <laughs> Dobry wieczór. 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 Dobry This presentation is about Abacua. It's basically my whole life work with this backup tool. Uh, this is things that I like from Poland. Vodka, you were famous for that. The people, I'm just feeling home because you are so warm, you are so uh, cozy. I'm, I, I really feel like I'm, I'm home when, I, when I'm here in Poland. It's my first time, but uh, I hope I can come to other events. This is, uh, I know the singer, it's not Polish, but uh, I think he has a band here, do you know the singer? Gordon Bregovich. Is it famous? Do you know the song, the Kalishnikov song? Yes. yes. Yeah, can you sing with for me, please? <laughs> really? Please, yeah, one, two, three. 
Bom, 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 bom. <laughs> no, you don't know the song. No worries, well, what a failure. <laughs> uh, okay, who am I? I'm a LPI 3 certified sysadmin. I designed the first backup disk storage appliance, only one with Kinab storage. I'm a Bacala teacher. Uh, I do in company and remote classes, okay? I'll be uh, giving at the end of this presentation, I'll be sorting. Uh, my video classes that are available on udemy.com uh, I'll show the website, okay, so I'll sort through the uh, listening uh, and I'm the author of a Bacula book in Portuguese I'm translating in it uh, to English and this is all, th there's two uh, things here, the video classes and the, the book I'll be glad if there is anyone here at this audience that can help me with a Polish translate, translation, maybe, so we can share the, the profits, okay? Uh, this is the site that will have my video class. One of you will get my video class at the end, at the end of the presentation. I'm also a free software promoter. I really like f free software and free not in the meaning of uh, with no expense but uh, free from freedom okay freedom software uh, it creates jobs locally here in Poland it creates jobs in Brazil it creates uh, jobs you know, all over the world uh, and this doesn't happen uh, very much with uh, property software okay all the jobs the better jobs they are at the company headquarters this is my site, I will show you later because I'm, we, I already had some problems here the, but this presentation will be also hands-on so I will show my website when you can get uh, uh, many technical documents about Bacla written by me and also my contacts, okay, email, uh, Skype and everything else The name, do you know what Bacla means? <laughs> Very creative, you know, okay? Uh, backups usually happens at night, okay? You can do it anytime, but at night, at night usually is the best time because you don't have people working at your systems, you have less open files, so it usually is made at night and there's the analogy of the Dracula. You suck the blood. It's a fully feature open source backup tool. It is uh, multi platform since it is developed in, in C and C, so you can basically uh, build the binaries for any operational system. Okay. It supports basically any uh, storage device that, that uh, Linux can uh, recognize. Okay. Tape device, tape libraries, tape drivers. Uh, hard disks, uh, solid disks, okay? It's the most popular backup tool in Brazil uh, and it's the third most popular backup software worldwide. How do I know that? Google Trends. Do you know Google Trends? Google Trends is a nice tool to know uh, this kind of stuff. It's like the API for Google. It's free. You can basically check the the popularity of any Google carry. Uh, this is uh, some features about Bacula. Multi volumes backup. Okay, you can have backups in one tape, in two tapes, and it will just uh, continue doing backup. Uh, multi backups to the same volume, to the same disk, to the same tape. <laughs> File level, uh, incremental differential backup jobs, this any backup tool does. Uh, copy and migration jobs, this is very good because you do a backup on a storage, you can just uh, program back like, to copy it to another storage, okay? For example, for disk to tape, to tape to another tape, okay? Uh, and this is the single, uh, that I think, most important feature of back, okay? This one here, there is a laser here. Uh, free backup storage format, okay? Property backup software, they use, they use a special format, okay? So you can only 
restore that backup with the same version of that software. Okay, this is the vendor locking. With Bacla, this doesn't happen. The format is just open. If you don't have Bacla anymore in some contingent case, you can just use tar or dump from uh, Unix commands, okay? Unix and Linux. Uh, we have several graphical interface. I will show you some. A friend text console. For me, I prefer test, okay? Personally. Uh, before and after job script, which is very important to backups, to do backup of specific applications, okay? For example, MySQL, uh, you have to dump it, okay? Uh, before you backup, so you can use a script. And it is important the, to the backup software to call this script, because if it is in on error, if the script terminates on error, you can fail, you have the option to, to fail automatically that backup job and you has receive an email, okay, this job terminated, this backup job terminated on error because the script that generates the MySQL dump doesn't run okay. This is cruel, this last presentation you are all like tired. <laughs> Uh, data encryption, uh, you can, every backup software needs a database, okay? So, Bacula, you can use any of this one here. SQLite, uh, more for testing, the most used is Post, uh, are Postgres and MySQL. Uh, it supports two compression algorithms, uh, LZO and GZIP, bandwidth limit, no memory leak, Bacula is made to be running for days, for months, for years, so it is uh, uh, designed to have very little memory leak, okay? Uh, we aim at the community 30 years of backwards compatibility, okay? If we do a backup today with Bacula, we expect to be able to restore it 30 years in the future, okay? In 2045, we still uh, can restore files that I back up to Bacla today, with Bacla today, okay? Uh, automatic volume recycle after retention, okay? Do you know what is retention or backup? Who works with backup here? Who is, who are, is network uh, system administrator? Developers and uh, those who doesn't <laughs> <laughs> just curious. Okay, marketing. Marketing. Oh, nice. And GFS. It's the most used. It's not actually a backlog thing. You know, GFS. It's a ro the most used backup rotation scheme. Okay. It's a. It's hard to explain in a few seconds, but uh, basically are daily backups that usually are differential or incremental, weekly backups that you do once a week, like the name says, and monthly that you do once a month. Each one of these levels, you retain this backup for more time. The daily, you usually keep it for one week, then you recycle it, you erase the tape because you already do the weekly, okay? The weekly backups, you, you retain it for one month, because in that period you already did probably the monthly backup, and the monthly backup you keep it for more time, for months, six months, one year, okay? Yes, you can read after. This is the main platforms that Bacula can run and can backup, the Bacula clients can be installed, okay? It's a network backup software, it's low modular, this is, uh, gives him it lots of uh, flexibility, okay, flexi uh, flexibility, okay? You can have all this de those demos on the same machine, okay? The director is the core of Bacula, okay? It runs, it has the scheduler, it has all Bacula configurations, okay? 
and it it manages all the backup execution. Okay, so uh, it's like a, it's a back, the backup server. Okay, if you uh, want to call it that way, but you have the storage demo. Any machine that you have a tape library, any machine that you want to restore backup, you will have a storage demo on it. Okay. And you have the file demo, it's the backup clients. So any machine that you want to extract backup to copy files from the machine, you have the file demo installed and running. Right? Database, I already told that Baglo has one. Who are the backup tools? They have database, they have catalogs, like we call. Anyone know? When the backup software does the backup, he uh, stores it in byte sequence, okay? Do you know byte sequence? There's no file system there. Why there's no file system? Because it's faster, it takes uh, less space from the media, okay? From the, from the medium, so you can write more information, okay? Since you don't have a file system in, in that medium, for example, tapes, tapes, they are sequential writing device, okay? You don't have a file system there. So, you have, uh, you must have a database that makes the association. Which file is in which tape? What was, when the backup was run, the attributes, the, the file attributes, okay? Permissions and every stuff, okay? And there is only one hole here that I forgot, uh, it crashed. It's not Windows, but it crashed. Uh, there is only one whole one rule that I forgot to mention. Okay, you can have all that mo that uh, demons in, in separate machines, or sometimes you can have them in on the same machine. Okay, the only rule about that that it's very logical, but some people forget that the the machine that hosts the backward director. Okay, it's the core. It controls every backup operation, should also have a file demo installed, installed on itself because you have to backup also the backup server, okay? It's configurations and logs and stuff, all right? And mostly the catalog, okay? The, the backlog database because it is very important if you, lose, if you lose your backup server, you must be able to restore it in the, cat, in the catalog and every stuff that is there, okay? So you'll be able to restore everything else, okay? So here it's your machine, you can access Bacula from several interfaces, okay? Uh, when running a backup, the Bacula director connects to the client, Okay, it can be Windows, it can be Linux, it can be Unix, any clients installed on your network. And then the clients, they send the data to the storage demon. You, you can see that uh, the data traffic, it doesn't go through the director, okay? It goes straight to the storage demon. Okay, it's logical. Sometimes you people use the director, the database, and the storage demo on the same machine. Okay, everything on the same machine from for the server. Okay, I will show you how to install to build Bible from binaries. Everything. Okay, so a backup server. This is a diagram about Bible objects. Of course, I. Wouldn't be able to teach you everything about backup today, but this is more or less the, ba the backup objects that Bacula has. Okay, that Bacula have. Uh, you have the catalog. On the catalog, you have information about pools. Uh, pool. I usually make an analogy with uh, who, who knows directory services. LDAP, Active Directory. Okay, you have objects and you have object groups, okay, groups of objects. Pool, it's like a group from the Active Directory, okay? On the pool, you have several volumes, 
okay, volumes are the uh, logical partition where you are going to store your data, okay, the sequential bytes, the, the, the byte sequence that you store your data, okay, they are on the volumes. For hard disks, you can have a set of volumes, okay, the backlog volumes. Those volumes uh, are just files for backlog, okay, you will have file 1, file 2, file 3, and they will uh, receive data from the backup. For tape, it's a tape characteristic. You can only have one volume per tape, okay? Until now, you can only have one volume per tape, okay? Uh, so this is a, a feature from tapes. And then you can store many jobs. Any question until now? Are you understanding? Okay. On this presentation, I don't know if you have time, you know, but I'll try to build binaries from the source, okay? I will inst make installation of the backlog server with director, storage daemon, file daemon, catalog, consoles, uh, on the same machine, okay? I will run some backup jobs for you. I will display some of the newer backlog version features. Uh, something about catalog tuning, how to make the backlog database faster, and specific applications backup. Okay? This is another challenge. Uh, okay. That's another, another challenge. Let me try to. Maybe if I reuse big letters, maybe. Okay, this is my website. Uh, with some luck, you can get here to the blog. And there is a translator, machine translator, because it's on in Portuguese, but you can, oh my god, it would be very hard to find the Polish flag for it. To the left. Okay, okay, guide me. Down, left. No, I had an idea. I'm... One line. Down. No, or, no I, I think this way. I will be... It's the only way I can do that. This one? Yes. Okay, so uh, I just... Getting here to you to check my okay. I think this is about. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh. Yes. <laughs> okay. So here my contacts. Okay, my mail, everything you need to know to find me. This is my video class at Udemy. Udemy, for those who doesn't know, it's a website with several trainings, online trainings. Okay, video classes, and this is mine. But what I really want to show you now is that we're going to install Bacula in very few minutes, okay? Bacula 7, it's, it, it is the last release, okay? But you know Linux, who, who works with Linux here? Oh, we have very few people. I'm disappointed with you. <laughs> okay. When there is a release, uh, Linux, why Linux is a little safer than Windows? Because uh, we have this compatibility matrix, okay, between operational system and applications, okay? So when a new version of Backlog, the 705, was released, the main operational systems, they don't release it yet for uh, the binaries for, for Debian, for Ubuntu, okay? Uh, so, I, I think building it 
from source, it's a nice option. Okay? I already downloaded the code. Okay? I went to the backlog source forge project, downloaded to uh, USR SRC. Okay? It's uh, the path that you usually download source code into Linux distribution. Okay? I uh, unpack. Uh, uncompress uh, un un the package, okay? Uh, okay. I just uncompress the package, so it makes a directory here. Here I have my backlog source code, okay? Uh, there are some dependencies in my site, website, they are well documented, okay? Uh, Lead my SQL dev are the readers in order you can build the C application that use, uh, that connects to my SQL database. Build Essential is the base for uh, Debian-like systems, okay? It provides the make package, the compiler, the GNU compiler, okay? Uh, Libreed line, it's a nice, it's all optional, but it provides nice features to the Bacula text console that I'll show you, like autocompletion, like history, okay? Uh, the lib is the zip library, is the compression that Bacula uses, so I need it to build the Bacula binaries. NPX, it's the Linux uh, tape library handler, okay? It makes all the operations of tape library, so it's a nice package. Only install it if you have a tape library. Postfix, in order to backlog, send mails. I can install this machine like I'm doing, or I can send backlog mail through a mail server, any mail server also. And this other one is to backup uh, Linux access control list, okay? Uh, I installed the dependencies, now I can make the configure. Now you're going to screen, okay? Uh, it is only big like this because I'm uh, uh, trying to make your life easier, actually, okay? Here, we are already making some configuration for your Bacula installation, okay? With Readline, it, it, it is that features, that con text console features that I told you. Uh, these other paths here are paths that uh, the people that uh, make the Debian Bacula packages, they, they usually uh, set the specs, okay? So if I make another upgrade from Debian packages, uh, it will just overwrite this installation. So what I'm trying to do here, put everything on the same place that a Debian developer would do, okay? Uh, working the log director, is enable smart log. It's important to make a better usage of foreign memory, avoid leaking. With MySQL, this is very important. With MySQL, I'm telling Bacula that I'm going to use a MySQL uh, database to host its catalog. Okay. Here, I'm already making my life easier because I'm already telling Bacula where it will store disk-based backups, okay, so I'm already configuring it here. My email, also to Bacula, uh, I could change it later, okay, on Bacula config file, but I'm just making it easy. And my host name, this is very important. I'm using localhost here because I'm on a laboratory environment, but you should not use localhost, okay, you should use uh, and then at the address that your machines that will be backed that they can access, okay? So you probably will have a static IP or name, it can be a name that your DNS can resolve, okay? So you, here we would use the 
interface address for this machine, ok? Now it will check if everything is ok, if you have all the dependencies that the, he need, the Bagua needs to, to be built, ok? Any question, guys? No? Ok, this is here is important, ok? It's just a, a message that everything's ok, every settings that we use, they are, they are fine. At this moment, it would be nice if we also install the database, ok? I always uh, recommend you to install the database before install Oracle, ok? So I could just do apt-get install MySQL server. It's very easy to install databases on Linux, ok? It's already installed. Uh, the configuration is done, it's ok. Until now, I haven't uh, uh, I haven't changed anything in the operational system, ok? I just uh, make the settings, ok? That will lead me to build the binaries. Here I can proceed, I can proceed with the make, ok? Now I'm building the binaries. There is some hint here, who, use, uh, who usually make C applications build. Do you know you can use several cores, several processor cores for do that? Uh, nice. If you don't, if you just do make, it will only use one processor core, okay, to make the compilation. If you use make J I don't need any number, 4, 8, ok? Probably the, the how many cores do you have, it, it can be more, ok? There is no problem. It will split this compilation job in several uh, sub-jobs, so it will uh, parallel processing, ok? The, There, there is no use here because I'm, I'm on a virtual machine with a single core. But Uh, three or four people they work with backup. Who are, oh, someone works with Bagua? Do you like it? <laughs> <laughs> How come? Why? What? The duplication. Okay. I just build the binaries, ok? Now I want to proceed with uh, making install 